Jamie Bodie with JLK Events here today taking a look at the uh, Chauvet FlareCon Air and I'll show you this little system here. I'm going to try to walk you through two different videos, one of how to set it up and the second on actually using it with the lights. But first thing we need to do is plug it in. Let's go ahead and plug this in. Let it come on and it's kind of doing its boot up thing. In the meantime, we're going to take our phone, go over to the uh, the settings wherever you would look at your uh, Wi-Fi, Wi and choose the one we've set this one up to say Chauvet DJ. Uh, it comes, it says something else when you get it, but it's pretty easy to identify. You just log in there. So what you're doing, this thing is creating a Wi-Fi network, and you are logging in to the Wi-Fi network network of the FlareCon Air. Come back over here and go to the FlareCon app, which if you don't already have on your phone, you do have to download. You can download it at, uh, at the Play Store or uh, for the Apple, you can get, get it for that as well. All right, so kind of looking at that, we're, we're all ready. We're going to choose uh, the light on the phone that is the one with the greatest number of, uh, of LEDs. So we have a Freedom Par Quad 4 and a Freedom Par Tri 6, so we're going to choose the Quad 4 here. All right, now the lights themselves have to be set up. The first thing you're going to want to know when setting up the lights is right now the lights have to be in the number one DMX address. So here's our DMX address, we're already set on one. And then we scroll through until we get to STR. All right, hit enter. This is DMX receive channel, and then we hit enter. Over here on our Flarecon base, I don't know whether you can see it or not, but it says we're on channel 16, and we have selected channel 16 on this one as well. So if you wanted to run two different groups, or three or four different groups, it wouldn't matter as long as you had a FlareCon Air associated with each group. Okay, so we want to be on D1. We've got that. Go back over here to SDR, hit enter. I'm going to hit enter again, make sure I'm on 16. I am. So I'm going to hit enter one more time, go back to menu. Now you have to be in this particular light because this is the Tri 6. We need to be in the three channel mode and on the Freedom Par Quad 4, we'll be in the four channel mode to make all of this work. So now we have, we have our FlareCon Air set up. We have our phone set up ready to work. We have our light set up and it's ready to receive the signal. So all we do now is take our phone, turn this around now, all right, you can see that's blue. And on my phone, I can just choose a color on here and they will automatically go to that color. So that's kind of real quickly how you set it up. Uh, you have to go through, it's pretty well spelled out in the manual. Uh, I figured it out without a whole lot of trouble. Just a little bit of Casey's help. But uh, that's getting your phone set up. You log in to to the FlareCon with on your Wi-Fi. Then you set up your lights to receive the signal from the FlareCon. Now, if you had wireless DMX, you could also bring wireless DMX in here. You could run wirelessly from the FlareCon to a Freedom Par, and then if you wanted to run wireless DMX from there, you could run a wire out of this fixture and to the next fixture, whatever you wanted to use and be able to do uh, wireless DMX using the flare content. <laughs>